Hey guys, welcome back. In the previous video, we looked at um, the properties for the lights in Blender. I've got a pretty simple uh, scene here and we've got a, an area light that is shining a blue light, uh, like it's a night scene. And then we, in the middle, we have a point light uh, that is uh, depicting maybe a flame like a campfire uh, and we're going to in this video we are going to make this light flicker we'll throw in a flicker effect it's called a noise modifier uh, to make it look like that light is flickering like a like a, a fire and so let's go ahead and get started it's a very simple scene guys it's just uh, four spheres a cube a very very thin cube that is uh, representing the ground, a point light here that is representing the fire, and of course the area light, which I mentioned, which is representing the ambient light or the moonlight. All right, let's go ahead and select this point light. And the first thing I'd like to do is keyframe the intensity or the power. At frame one, I want this to be at zero. Zero. So I'm gonna click this little dot to the right of the power, right here, to animate the property. Click. So we've got a, a uh, we've got a keyframe on frame one. I'm gonna go all the way to frame 50, the end of the animation, and I'm gonna animate this. Uh, I'm gonna click here, maybe a thousand. <clears throat> a thousand and so if I hit play this animation goes from zero to a thousand and it doesn't hold on let me check let's go a thousand Boom. let's hit this to uh, keyframe that and now if I hit play it just gradually goes from zero to a thousand and that's not what we want we want it to flicker and so what I what we need to do is bring up the graph editor. I'm gonna put my cursor uh, on this corner, bring up a new window, and select the graph editor. I'm gonna hit the home key to zoom out and reveal the um, the graph for the power. I'm also going to hit the N key the N for Nancy, or I can hit the little the little arrow right there, but I'm going to hit N to bring up the properties uh, for the power. Now, there's three tabs, and one of them is the modifiers. I'm going to open it up just a bit more. And I am going to add a modifier. Add modifier right here. It's going to be a noise modifier, and bam, there it is. Uh, if I hit play, nothing happened. I mean, something happened, but it's too little. We can't see it. So let's go ahead and modify it. The first thing I'd like to do is move this keyframe all the way up to a thousand uh, and then have it constant. There is no animation. There's no gradual build up anymore. But what that does, it, it gives us a good starting position for this modifier. The strength is at one. So I'm gonna crank this up to maybe 500. And there we can see, there we can see uh, the flicker effect or the m noise modifier. If I hit play, we I can barely see it. So I need to increase my strength, uh, maybe to a thousand, maybe even more. Let's uh, increase it to 1500. There we go. And let's see what that does. There we go. It's just too fast. It's a little fast, so we can scale it. This scale bunches up the, um, the waves or decreases them. So I'm going to scale it up to 1.6 and see what that does. There we go. I think it's a little fast still. Uh, so let's uh, increase it a little bit more, maybe the two. And 
and see what that did. Boom, there it is. Uh, and in fact, now the strength seems a little too much. There we go. And there it is. There's the little flicker that we needed for the fire. If you need to do this, guys, uh, it's really easy. You do it in the graph editor, add a modifier, click on the strength and the scale. And then the offset just moves it to allow a different wave. If you don't like that wave, uh, you're seeing this. This is the er an error because of the, pro the uh, rendering. It just needs to catch up. Once the rendering catches up, it, uh, it, it's all good. Um, offset. And the depth is how, how sharp that is. I'm going to go back to zero. And the phase is just the randomness of the wave. Let me hit play. There it is. Let me see if... Uh, I believe that this, this black part here is a, a, an error, a bug from the renderer. Hey guys, so it's just a matter of playing with the settings. I found that I like this flicker. It's the scale is at 1.6. The strength is at 1500. There's a zero offset. The phase is, uh, the face doesn't really matter. The face is just a variance of this wave and the depth of zero. And I like this uh, flicker effect. Again, you just have to play with it and see what you like. It's really, really easy. Again, it's in the graph editor and it's um, in the modifiers, add a modifier, a noise modifier, and bam, there it is. Hey guys, I hope you found this video to be helpful. And if you liked the video, go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Thank you.